This InfoWorks 2024 video is going to look at how you can add content and decorations to your road, bridge and tunnel designs. So here I've created a tunnel and I've created a component road and in that component road it has a chain fence running the entire length of the component road. So through the tunnel and over the bridge. Here I can manually drag and drop the start station, the end station, adjust the length to suit, or I can type in the length or the end station to get the desired result. I can also adjust the decorations that have been added to this component road. So there's a few things we can do here in terms of placing decorations or splitting features. I want to change the light poles to be a barrier in the center of my bridge design. So there are hundreds of different of decorations you can choose from. I'm going to type barrier to filter through to get the barrier that I want for my project. I can also adjust the thumbnails here to better see what I'm selecting. I'll choose the barrier style and then it will place it. By default, it's doing it at 30 meter intervals because of the original light poles. I can adjust that to be 3.1 meters. That's the spacing of the barrier. I can click in the model hit enter to complete that command. And now I have some barriers running through the middle of these roads. Next, I wanna look at how they align with the curvature of the bridge. So I can turn on tilting, hit refresh, and now it will follow the curvature of the bridge. We also have other tools to adjust the component road. So I can adjust the width of each road, or if I want to add, say, a, a cycle lane, I can make the footpath, the sidewalk, wider. So this is going from 2.5 meters to 4 meters. And now, I can add more decorations to the footpath, the sidewalk, including a cycle walk or cycle lane decal. So there's a number of things you can add here. I just want to place decorations, type in bike decal, and then this has uh, an alpha channel in it, so it will paint, in essence, the decal onto the sidewalk here. Uh, if you click too quickly, it will duplicate it. So just go slow and you'll see here, we have our bike decal showing. I can make some adjustments to the spacing, to the offsets, but now I've made adjustments to the decorations of the road. Other cool things that we have inside of InfoWorks is localized content. So here in the ANZ, Australian New Zealand localized content, we can load in local geometry, local decorations for our bridge design. So I want to place this signage decoration so I can type in the name of that signage and it will find it in the component library. This will then go and place it on the part of the bridge that I want to select. So when I highlight over the side of the road here where the barriers are, it will place it. It will default to the spacing that those barriers were set up. I can then go and make adjustment to the spacing. So I go from 10 meters to say 500 meters. I can do horizontal offsets. I can rotate it as well. So here the spacing is a lot more generous but I want to now rotate it. So I can rotate it 90 degrees, and then I can go to the horizontal offset and then set it one meter so it's actually sitting in the curb and the sidewalk. And now I have some local ANZ content aligned to my bridge and component road design. 